Hey, internet friends, I'm Ryan, and this is Demos in the Dark. If this is your first time checking out the channel, welcome. We do weekly gear demos here. I demo from builders big and small, builders you've heard of, and if I'm doing my job right, builders you haven't. Now, uh, I know you don't really like me talking all that much, but I do have kind of a cool story. Uh, of how this particular uh, pedal demo came into fruition. Uh, a, a Instagram and a YouTube friend named Tyler sent me a article, an article, um, <laughs> one, one day. And the article was about this pedal called the Paradrive by Cole Music. And he said, hey, I want you to check this out. And I was like, yeah, you know what? I've never even heard of that, and I don't know them. But um, I can certainly give them a shout and see what they think. And uh, so I emailed Cole Music and they were like, oh, yeah, this dude Tyler was just telling us about you. We are ready for this. So uh, he facilitated this whole thing. And uh, Tyler, I'm not going to do this every time this happens, but Tyler, I want you to know I'm going to grab your shipping address and uh, you just earned yourself a really, really cool overdrive pedal. So the Paradrive from Cold Music is uh, kind of the the tweaker's dream or the studio nerd's dream. Uh, it is an overdrive that has a really active EQ change. You can boost or duck certain signals of your choosing. So if you have a really uh, scooped amp that you want to add some mids to, you can do that. If you have an annoying frequency that you want to get rid of, you can do that as well. Uh, it's just super cool. So uh, I got a Gibson ES-339 run into a Benson Amps Monarch Reverb. Sounds like this. We'll just kind of go over uh, setting uh, just a sound and some of the options that you have with that. So we're starting with everything basically zeroed out. It's cool, but uh, how about some more low end? So uh, we'll bring in some 200 and we will boost it by 6 dB. Let's see how that sounds. <laughs> Boost it even more. So that was the 400 there, boosting that 400 quite a bit. Uh, let's pull that back. Let's duck the 400 and see how that sounds. Duck it even more. Play with this some more. Let's uh, bring in some 800. Bring it in even more. Ooh, let's duck it out. Pedal also has two different clipping options. What we've been using are 4, 1, and 9, 14s, and on the, which I really enjoy a lot, by the way. And on the right side, we have two Bat 41s, so let's just compare those.
this pedal is basically just a problem solver or an enhancer. It, it's it's going to sound different depending on the amp that you use, the guitar that you use, and then you can just tweak things as you need them. If you're in a room where you're not feeling like you're getting the same response that you usually do, and whatever, I mean, like, just fix it. Fix it with this pedal. We're going to dime everything out at 10, as is the policy here at Demos in the Dark. <laughs> Oh, my God. 